Oh my word. I was on mute. I've been talking this whole time and you didn't even hear me. Nobody even said anything till Meredith. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Oh my word. There we go. I'm back. I said we were making fun of Mama Joyful. I said I put her to work over here. She's don't say hi to her because she has a job to do. Don't interrupt my labors. I might get beaten. <laughs> or she won't feed me a donut. Right. She won't <laughs> get no donuts if you don't if you don't do your work. It wasn't your phone, it was me, girl. Is Mama Joyful a morning person as well? Well, yes. I, as I woke her up early this morning. It's a good thing my sugar was under 40. I knew something was wrong when I woke her up. <laughs> and then when she finally came down the hall, I knew something was wrong. Because she wasn't walking normal. She was like, clump, clump, clump. And I'm like, what on earth? She was walking down the hall like a toddler. Like, what is she stomping her feet for? And she got out here and she's like, I think my sugar's low. So she gave me a rotten banana. And a glass of orange juice, and then up it went up over 200. So, <laughs> I got her going though. That's all that matters. She's like, oh, it's coming back down. 189. All right. Now. See, the juice was the right thing. But I had to take insulin when I got up over 200. So, <laughs> seesaw. It's my fault. I fed her oatmeal for supper last night, and that doesn't do well with her apparently. <laughs> all right, guys. We are going to make some donuts this morning. We are going to make some chocolate coated donuts. We're going to make some, maybe, that's a big old hair, gross. Maybe some peanut butter frosted donuts. I don't know yet if we're going to do that, maybe. Um, but we're definitely going to do sugar coated and uh, not sugar coated, but what appears to be sugar coated powdered donuts and cinnamon powder donuts is what we're going to make today. So, we are gonna be following the basic donut recipe from Trim Healthy Cookbook. It is on page 268. If you do not uh, have that cookbook, you need to go buy it. <gasps> I may or may not have eaten a Milky Way and a Crunch Bar already this morning or two, but they're so good. So this is what I'm going to use. This is a dash donut maker. Isn't it cute? They make little mini they donuts. Are, they are tiny, aren't they? They are. Well, they're mini. They don't call them mini because they're big. Let's make as much racket as possible. A measuring cup one-third please of that one-third of a cup of yogurt we're putting yogurt the recipe doesn't call for yogurt calls for something else if you want to know you're gonna to have to go look in the cookbook there already is coffee Bonnie um, so she had chocolate in it so I didn't like it I didn't like the coffee because it tasted like chocolate that makes sense yeah I like chocolate waste any of that nine dollar yogurt. Yeah I know. These are in Trim Healthy Cookbook. I'm having scrambled eggs with a side of Milky Way Almond Joy and Crunch <laughs> Bar. Who's You're that? my kind of girl Jennifer. Oh. Those. Which Jennifer? There's only 200 in the group. <laughs> <laughs> this is Jennifer Valentine. All right, we need a little vanilla. It calls for some vanilla. Right? I agree. I agree with chocolate-covered espresso beans. This? Yep. Oh, that was supposed to be more vanilla than that. Something like that. Need a little almond milk. This is my joy almond milk. Spread some joy. Hashtag add. If you haven't gotten joy yet, 
uh, you should check it out. J-O-I, add J-O-I and use promo code JOYFULKJ to save some money. I love this stuff. Is that with one L or two? Like joyful, F-U-L-L, -L, or just F-U-L? The word joyful only has one L in it. Okay. Sometimes I get confused whether it has one or two. <laughs> Well, full has two L's, so. <laughs> but not joyful. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh, Lois, that's amazing. I use dairy-free yogurt and it's like six seventy nine dollars for a little tub. So I don't use a lot of it. All right, six to tap, seven tablespoons of melted butter. There's eight in here. They're giving me the option between six and seven. I think I'm going to go with seven. Because... Why wouldn't I go with extra butter? We'll save that one little tablespoon out for something. Is it melted? Yeah. Yeah. You, you want to melt Was that? it melted or softened? Yeah. Mel melted. So you need one of those little plastic things going over this so it doesn't splatter Put all over Put a paper it. towel over it. Well, I know, but I mean, if you had one of those things. They melt. They do. I've had mine for years and it's still the same. Well, mine melted. I got a cheap one. I don't, how do I make dairy free yogurt, Marianne? I'd say 30 seconds. This is a cup of baking blend. How would I make dairy free yogurt, Marianne? You tell me and I'll make some dairy free yogurt because it is expensive. Yeah, right. Joyful, but joyfully has two L's. Right. English is weird, Bonnie says. She's not wrong. Marin is Marin is doing English language arts in school. And she, oh my gosh, she's always like, Mom, can you tell me what the integrative, inverted, adjectative <laughs> adverb is in this sentence? I'm like, absolutely not. Google it because I don't know. Just a little bit more because I have no idea. I can tell you what the noun, the verb, the adverb, and the adjective. Beyond that, don't ask me no prepositional nothing, nothing. I don't know and I don't care. Right. And I don't think it matters. Sorry if you're an English teacher and I just told you it didn't matter, but for me it doesn't matter. All right. Teaspoon of baking powder. I didn't read the instructions. I don't know if I'm supposed to separate this stuff. Wait a minute, it says a quarter cup of the melted butter goes in the donuts. The rest is to brush on top. Tracy, Alan, do you brush butter on top of yours? Remove the donuts from the maker and brush with the remaining butter. Oopsie. Okay, so we only need a quarter cup of melted butter. Good thing I read ahead. Is this a quarter cup? This one, There's I got it right here. Oh. Where's my mixer? Right here, all right. I'm going to mix it up some before I pour in the hot butter. I could just see that pouring in yeah. my drawer. I thought all over that my, too. All over my silverware. <laughs> That's one more thing she needs to clean before she leaves. <laughs> okay. I should have made a double batch. This ain't enough. It's not enough here. Well, how many do you need? I know a lot. Oh. I'm going on vacay. Oh. I need donuts for vacay. Let's double it. Let's double it. Let's let's just go for it. No, I think there's going to be plenty there. We'll just spray it with cooking spray to keep the topping on. That's fine. Oh. Let's see. Let's double it. Let's add three more eggs. Because they're cheap. Hey, guess what, Bonnie? If you pour your liquid in a dry measuring cup, guess what? Measures the same. The same. Don't be wasting your time with a special measuring cup for liquid. Oh, man. I just missed the trash can with those shells, and they went all over the floor over there behind them. I ain't cleaning it. Excuse me. If you want donuts, you will. 
Can I have some more Greek yogurt? Dairy-free yogurt? I need a third of a cup if there's that much there left. Isn't. Well, just put what you got in here. Just go with it. It's just kind of a little scraping. Oh, that's plenty. It's probably close enough. It's creamy. You could probably make yogurt out of goat's milk, couldn't you, if you ever get it? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I need to get some goat's milk. When I get back from vacation, that's what I'm doing. I'm going to get a goat. The, the people at work said they're going to um, they're gonna combine efforts and buy me a goat. I'm like, and Tony you show up at my house out. with Secret Santa, a goat, I'm not going to be happy. <laughs> not only you. Imagine somebody showed up with a goat. Tilson may have a small issue with that. Oh, what else? Quarter cup of butter. Do you need this? Oh, look at that. That was perfect. Do you need this? Anymore? I don't think so. What else? A cup of baking blend. Uh oh. I don't have a cup. I hope I have more. Wait, I know I do. I just bought some. Where do you think I put it though? That's the question. Oh, you know what? Let's just throw a little no carb easy bread in there to make up the difference. It'll be fine. It will be fine. What do we got? Oh, that would be fun, Marianne. A secret sisters in the joyful community. It would be fun. This is not baking blend. I'm not going to promise the outcome. I'm sure, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. I'm the master of no carb easy bread, so I shouldn't have said that. Now they're going to come out terrible. What else? Bacon powder. are perfectly organized, Bonnie. I know where everything is. So is that. Did you double that? Yep. Oh, salt. I didn't put that in the first batch. So, a quarter teaspoon. Um, half a cup. So I need a whole cup of gentle sweet. Did I put gentle sweet in the other batch? I don't think I did. It ain't They here. are now. They are now, Miriam, because I just ran out of bacon blend. These are the basic donuts from Trim Healthy Cookbook. Bless you. <coughs> um, gentle sweet. Do you think I'll... It was empty last night. Yeah, and I poured some stuff in it. It's, I'm like the, the widow with the <laughs> self-filling gentle sweet. Um, Wait, I need a say? cup. This one right here. Wait, what? Bless you. She wipes it on the apron. <laughs> I better watch. Hey, my cabinets are organized now, Bonnie. Look in that cabinet right there. Do you see those Tupperware containers? Not only are they organized, they are labeled. They are labeled. Wait, a cup? This seems like a lot of sweetener. Okay. So it really was a half a cup? Yes, but I doubled the recipe. Right. right. Math. So if I had added that in the beginning, I would have realized it was probably plenty of batter. But because I hadn't added it, it didn't look like a lot of batter. Now I have too much. I've had this pump for five years. Hopefully, 
I can get the new pump that talks to a sensor so that if I'm going real low, it'll shut off my basal. And... You need one that screams at you, wake up! Yeah. So when your daughter goes into wake you up. The only out... thing is I have uh, qualms about getting it because uh, my diabetic educator said the f you have to fill the reservoir with a needle instead of how this, this is so easy, as she said it. Gotta make sure all the air bubbles are out and all that. She has a Dexcom now, but yeah. this is a, a pump that will read her blood sugar at the same time. Right, and send it to the... She does wear a Dexcom, yeah. but her basal, it will still give her basal insulin when her blood sugar is going down because the Dexcom isn't, isn't telling the machine to shut off. No. So doesn't. she's still over there feeding herself insulin. One's Dexcom and one's Mectronic. It did, doesn't. but she didn't wake up, Marianne. Yeah, usually I low. do. I think it was too yeah. low. I don't know. Usually it wakes me up. I'll never forget going to the Women of Faith Conference in Connecticut. <laughs> and we, there was thousands, <laughs> I mean thousands of women there. And it was time to leave for the night. And we came down the stairs like we came down the stairs right. and got into this hallway and i mean yeah. it was like cattle yeah being it, we were all shoulder to shoulder and mom <laughs> reaches over and puts her hand in my pocket i'm like okay she just doesn't want to lose me she had her hand in my pocket and was holding on tight to the pocket i'm like okay so i looped my arm around her and i'm like let's go let's go what i didn't realize is that her sugar was dropping low. And she, I mean, she was, by the time we get to the end of the hallway, she was walking with me and she was like, <laughs> I'm like, what is wrong with you? It took me a minute. I'm like, what are you doing? Come on. And she's, <laughs> we had to walk down this big set of stairs to go down to yeah. shop. And, and you looked at me and you're like, <laughs> I said, mom, is your sugar low? And she just did this. And so I, started, I didn't even have a Dexcom then. No, I, I started popping sugar tabs in her mouth and I was like, she won't mouth. She's like, she, she was going like this. They're falling out of her mouth. I'm like, eat your sugar. And then she just stood there and all of a sudden she's like, oh, okay, I'm good. <laughs> it was terrifying. Oh, Awful. All right. Ooh, do we pipe this in here, Trace? I'm assuming we pipe it. It's probably the best bet to not make a or to make a less of a mess. And then one time Roger was going out to groom the dogs in the van, and for some reason, it was the Lord turning him around, he came back to the house, and my old dog was standing, acting weird, uh, beside my chair, and I didn't hear Roger come in or anything, and so he wakes me up, and calls the ambulance because at that time I was, I was, well, it went down to 19 at one point, but he started feeding me the old sugar tabs. And by the time the ambulance got there, they, it was, I was back up to 50. So they, well, it's headed in the right direction. So they didn't do anything, but so I've had a couple episodes like that. Um, there was one time when I couldn't get a hold of her on the phone and I called the <laughs> police because I thought her sugar must be low and she was it was shortly after that yeah. and the police well, sheriff came and checked on her and she just left her cell phone in the house she was out <laughs> working in the grooming room <laughs> oh dear I mean highs are bad too they do damage but they're not as scary low, as a right. low well lows will kill you a high will kill you slowly yeah Whoopsie! Oh, Lows of kill you quick. Right. Easy way. Just fall asleep. Oh yes, it's just ideal. <laughs> <Gosh>. <laughs> well, I'd rather the one do time that in your than... life a Snickers can save your life. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Better laugh than cry. All right. Let's make some donuts, shall we? Tracy, you still watching? How long do I cook these? One to two minutes? Is that what you said? Let's see if I can get them as nice. Tracy makes these donuts out in Minnesota. Minnesota. Michigan. Minnesota. Wrong state. 
not even pronounced that way, Michigan. And she is the master of mini donuts. She makes them the most beautiful little mini donuts I've ever seen in my life. They look like something right out of the, you know, the little package that has the sugary. Yeah. Oh, dang it, I didn't spray. spray. Oh, Kelly, Kelly, Kelly. Well, let's just hope for the best on that. I like to make a royal mess. This may take four and a half months to do all this <laughs> batter in this little tiny waffle maker. Y'all look at this strand of gray hair. Just don't get it in the donut. All right. I'll just add some texture. Um, we are almost up to 100 viewers. Hey, if you are watching, I would love if you would share this video while you're watching because when you share it, it hits other people's news feeds and the more people that see it the more people that join and the more fun it is fun it is the more fun it is would you guys like to see the candy we made last night on a cooking with kj class would you like to see it well you're going to see it whether you want to or not i'm going to show you you don't get a choice check these out You get them packed away so good. On the bottom, we have adorable little Milky Way. I should bite into it so you can see what it looks like because I wouldn't want you to miss <laughs> what it looks like when you bite into the middle. Can you see the chocolate nougat and, caramel. and the caramel? Mm -hmm. Weirdo. The dog does. Those are Milky Way. Oh, mm. those are good. Oh, they're cold on the tea. These are better. These are adorable little. My nose is sharp. Oh. <laughs> I'm such a professional. <laughs> My nose is running. Those are Almond Joy. And these are my favorite. These are crunch bars. I'm telling you right now, they are phenomenalicious. Mom doesn't like those because they're too dark for her sweet little heart. But my heart's darker. Prefers darker chocolate, I should say. Listen, it's a sweatshirt, it's fine. All right, I think it was one to two minutes. <gasps> Oh, look at that. Then come right out. Oh. Tracy said to very gently flip them. Be very delicate with them, she said. Oh my gosh, are they stupid cute. Alright, do you want to grab the small bowl and we're going to coat it with some chocolate? Where? One of, down there, one of these glass ones. Yeah. Donuts, donuts. I'm happy about donuts. Sure you can. You have if you have a little donut maker, I mean shaper. I've actually seen some people use the bake it, basic donut recipe and cook it in um, loaves. Don't know how it would be, but I've heard people. I've heard of it happening before. They'd be better with white glaze on them. What kind? What do you mean? Oh, like we can do some. We can do some of those. Easy peasy. We can do some of those. Um, doesn't she look like Marin? I mean, doesn't Marin look like her? I agree. Marin's really? going to be a beauty because she looks like her grandmother. All right. I should check these. I know it's supposed to be one to two minutes, but let's, you know, first try. Oh, they're done. Oh my gosh, they're, yeah, they're hot, just so you know. Look how cute, we're going to let them cool for a couple of minutes before we, do you want to spray it this time? Or? No, I don't think it's necessary. Ah. 
Um, under that cabinet that you just got that bowl from, can you look and see if the Pampered Chef um, piping thingy is right near, close by? It's probably behind some stuff. Is it not still in the box? No. I don't know what it looks like. You need that out, I remember. It's like a... Too bad I didn't have some kitchen gadgets. I don't know where it went. Oh, well, he should I, have a bigger bag. Don't you have a well, bigger one? Yeah, but the corners are folded in, so it doesn't... Oh. I don't know what I did with that thing. Too I have, like, places, a piping thing. Too many things. You own too many stuff. Too much stuff. Oh, that was a good... I don't have that. What's that? The bamboo tongs. That would be good. I don't have that. I can use the little spatula. I don't have, I don't, where do you think I put that? Maybe it's over here. Nope. Who knows? I put it somewhere special. Oh, that's a good idea, Lisa. Those ones are going to be all cooked. I want them to be cooked. What do you mean? Well, I mean, you only put three in it. What are you talking about? You didn't fill that, did you? Yes, I did. Oh, I didn't see it. Where were you? I don't know. Oh, man. I wish I knew where that thingamajig was. I've got, you know, like the Pampered Chef Piper thing that you just squeeze. What am I ignoring? Put a Ziploc in a glass. Put it in the glass. Okay, yes. Like this. But then, see, by the second time that I fill it, it starts to look all gooey and I can't stand it. And I don't have any scissors in the kitchen. I suppose I could go get up there. I'd rather make a royal mess. It wouldn't be KJ's cooking without a mess, right? Oh, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. Use a Ziploc, cut a small hole, and put it into a tall drinking glass. Whoops, that one overflowed. Whoop. Oh, my work. Get, come on now. little thing works great. Did I already flip that? I don't know if I did. I'll be right back. I need to get scissors. This is the ultimate cooking show. This is called the chef's treat, the part that overflowed. I'm supposed to get to eat that. Is that how that works? Oh, look at you guys. You're so good. That works well. I didn't cut the hole in it yet. Gordon Ramsay would die. Are you using a Ziploc bag? Is that a Ziploc bag? You donkey. What a mess. Come on now. I ain't eating that. It's half cooked. I ain't eating half cooked bacon blend. I'll put it there until I'm done. Bacon blend doesn't taste no good, half cooked. Hi, Bass Master. What you doing? What's shaking? You here to say hi to the peeps? And say hi to the people. Say hi. 
Hey, whoops. Sorry, guys. Say hi. Oh, yeah. Bessie. Say hi. Hey, what's this? You said it's real me. Say you hi. might have some. Hey, look here. Say hi. This thing cooks quick. I think you have to cook them a little extra because of the no carb easy bread. That stuff requires a little extra cooking because because of the um, psyllium. Which end did I cut off? That one. <laughs> this is um, much faster than I expected it to be. The Dash Waffle Maker takes a lot longer. It seems to do the trick. anybody cutting pizza with scissors but hey girl I ain't opposed to it whatever gets it in my face I love me some pizza that's something I need to pack for vacation is some of my pizza crust from no sugar allowed they have great pizza crust oh there's a million options isn't there Marianne all right let's put a little touch of coconut oil in there, just a touch. Well, maybe not. Yes, I'm gonna, yes. A little bit. My goal was to clean my house today before vacation, but mom's taking care of that apparently. Any sort of space? Uh, right here. Mm. All right, these are Trim Healthy Mama chocolate chips and I'm adding a little oil to it. We're gonna dip some donuts. <coughs> that dark chocolate, chocolate chips. No, these are Trim Healthy Mama. Oh. I don't think they're dark. Are they dark? I'll just drop one. Mmm, they're good. They're better than Lily's or any of them. They are my favorite. Oh, you're so weird. I like the milk chocolate. If you guys haven't had Trim Healthy Mama chocolate chips, they are really hands down the best. I don't get stomach distress. I rate them as Trim Healthy Mama at the top of the list. Then down to um, I think we need a Mama and KJ photo shoot. She says, that's not a bad idea, Nikki. Um, Mama, um, Trim Healthy Mama chocolate chips are at the top of the list. Then Thrive Market chocolate chips below that. Then Lily's and then Bake Believe at the bottom. That's how I rank chocolate chips. If you care, you may not. You may not care my opinion on chocolate chips, but if you do, that's my opinion. So what are you doing them? About two minutes on each side? I'd say so, two to three minutes. I think they have to cook a little longer than just the basic donut recipe because of the no carb easy bread that's in there. That gives it, just needs a little extra. This dog begs chocolate every single time I cook with it. You can't have it, dude. It's not for you. No. It's not for you, buddy. No. It's not for you. It's not for you. Mmm, I got chocolate under my fingernails. See, three hours from now, I got snack time. <laughs> We're on the way to Pennsylvania. <laughs> um, no, I love the flavor of Bake Believe. I do not, however, like the fact that... With Bake Believe, I literally don't need to put gas in my car because I can propel myself to town <laughs> with the Bake Believe. They are, 
they cause a lot of distress. <laughs> Make believe are some serious powered chocolate chips. I can eat one little piece of Bake Believe and it is all over. <laughs> I mean, all over. <laughs> so they make their way to the bottom of my list. Oh, I haven't had those. That's right, chicory root toots. All right, I'm gonna dip a little donuts to see if those go just another minute Let's see if we can do this um what's her face tracy is way better at this part than i am but look these are gonna look just like little donuts from the store do you want mom to grab one of those plastic tupperware bowls out of the cupboard behind me and one of the covers and put some gentle sweet and cinnamon in it. And we'll make some cinnamon sugar donuts. The square one? No, the, uh, oh, this, these, oops. Use that cover, because I just got chocolate all over it. These are gonna be delightful. Can rice, cauliflower do what? Propel me across the state line. No, I don't have an issue. Yeah, yeah. I don't have much of an issue with that. Oh my gosh, these are cutesy. I can't get over how quick it is to make in this thing. Whoops, that one's gonna make a mess. and everywhere. Who needs to go off plan? Yeah, it's not as easy to go to Dunkin' Donuts. I mean, it's not as easy to do this as it is to walk into Dunkin' Donuts and grab some donuts. But this also doesn't come with diabetes and cancer and stroke and heart attack. You are worth the extra time, my friend. You are worth the effort. And I challenge you if you think, I don't have time to do this, KJ. Oh, girl, you're watching this video. You can find time. Quit watching Handmaid's Tale. And get up and make some donuts. Ouch, called out. We, in my coaching group, this month we are going to be doing, no, or not this month, next month, we are going to be doing No Excuses November, where we are going to talk about all the excuses we make to make unhealthy choices. Oh man, I just crumbled that one. And it's going to be a good month, because I'm going to challenge the excuses that you like to make. And I'm going to guess most of them can be challenged can be so how many of these would be a serving I don't know doesn't say a whole batch I guess maybe kidding joke that was a joke nobody eat a batch of donuts nobody eat a whole batch of donuts all right do you want to grab some gentle sweet or right here gentle sweet just pour a little pour some in there and then I'll get some cinnamon <laughs> make some cinnamon sugar throw some donuts in there and give it a shake shake yes that would be good on these um, I do want to make some crunchy nut covered ones too so uh, that will be the last batch that will be the last donuts that I make Drop a few of the, um, actually, before you drop three or four in there, pick the three or four, like do three, do three at a time. Let's, I'm going to put just a touch of cooking spray there. Now get them in there while they're wet. 
drop them in there. Oh, put that cover on or just do that. But I think if you put the cover on, they're going to get and shake them. They're going to get more coated. Oh. These are a S because they're full of eggs. This is the basic donut recipe, Nikki, from page 268 in Trip Healthy Cookbook. Um, but the tweaks are we used, Greek, these are Tracy's tweaks. We used Greek yogurt. Shoot, she sent me the tweaks and I didn't even pay attention. Did you want me to just put these on a plate or back on? Just right on here. Electric donut, okay, yeah. Yeah, we used yogurt instead of the sour cream that it calls for. I think I'm going to double dip, dip these chocolate. This way. Whoops. This is in Trim Healthy Cookbook, Marianne, page 268. And use Greek yogurt instead of sour cream. That is the recommendation from the famous donut maker, Tracy Allen. She knows what she's doing when it comes to making mini donuts beautifully. I'm going to double dip these so when they firm up, I'm going to dip them again. What, in chocolate again? Yeah. What do you mean, what? You don't think that sounds good, double dipped? No, Not with that chocolate. You're weird, Mama Joyful. You weird. Okay. There's some chocolate dipped ones. Let's see what we got here. I buy the on the butter sp spray oh, instead man. of Pam now. I get the Hannaford one, and they're always three twenty nine a can. They were on sale last week for a dollar ninety nine, so I scooped up a few of them. Yeah, so I got plenty to. It's last. a good deal. Yeah, and the butter in the Hannaford tastes more buttery than the. I so <clears throat> I made a double batch of these, and it called for a cup of baking blend. I did a cup and a half of baking blend and a half a cup of no carb easy bread. Not because I thought it would be a good match, but because I ran out of baking blend. I'm gonna store them in the fridge. Oh, they'll blast at least a week, at least. It is a dash, Sarah. Yep, it's a dash. I got it from Amazon. I can add it to my Amazon store, y'all. Did you guys know that if you click on one of my are you eating it already it ain't even cooled off yet is it any this good this is cold it tastes like a regular donut well give me a piece well i thought you were breaking it off i was gonna eat that you know letting go those are good those <coughs> they taste like regular donuts they do i'll be darned it's like those pumpkin cookies those are good no carb easy bread. Or maybe, or maybe if I do them, of course I have buy one of them, I'll use the no carb easy bread so they'll be like this. Part no carb easy bread. Don't do it yeah. all. Um, if Did you guys know that if you click on any of my Amazon links, it doesn't matter if it leads to deodorant. Whatever, I don't even think I have a link for deodorant. But whatever you click on for an Amazon link, if you click on it and look, you just click on it and then go search for whatever. Did you know that I earned commission on that? Hashtag ad. Did you know that? So whenever you have the opportunity, I sincerely appreciate it. Look, y'all, I'm working on life changes. And in order to do that, I and need to And her mother doesn't even help because I go buy something from Amazon and forget. <laughs> I always on. use the Trim Healthy Mama site. But then I always... Oh, shoot. You know what? I didn't want to use Gentle Sweet. What I wanted want to use Swerve because it's more light, white. It's more white looking for more like powder. It's, it's less granular. It's okay yeah, for these those, ones. These are good. But I want to do some other ones with... Oh, shoot. Back we up. were going to do some peanut butter, too. 
In fact, I'm going to eat another one. There are plenty. KJ, my food friend is allergic to almonds, nuts. I use brands for baking blend. What do you suggest amount for these? So um, I would use just a little extra liquid because Brianna's, Brianna's baking blend is just um, a little drier. I just add a little liquid or maybe an extra egg um, or, or you know what? Maybe a little bit of egg white. You could add a little bit of egg white to it. Sorry, Bassie. I eat it all. It ain't for you, dude. Dude, righteous dude. Did anybody get that reference? The righteous dude. Oh, reference. I didn't spray them. Oh, that's all right. I'll do it here. And I was asleep. I didn't. Oh, you wanted them to cool a little bit anyway. Right. Did anybody understand my righteous dude reference? I hope so. No, not Nemo. He's a righteous dude. First person that gets my reference of he's a righteous dude wins uh absolutely nothing just a high five yes was it? no vicky you're wrong vicky clink cells is right ferris that ferris is a righteous dude ferris bueller's day off i could watch that right now and this afternoon i wouldn't know the answer to that <laughs> <laughs> That little lady, the little, I can't think of her name. She was in so many movies in the 80s. She said that about Ferris. He's a righteous dude. All right. So, so what are you putting on these for? Huh? What are you putting on those for? I'm going to put regular powdered sugar, not powdered sugar, regular powdered sweetener, so not cinnamon. I think I better grab a different bowl because that dry, these dry hard and that would be messy. All right, I've got some swerve right here. Are you digging anything more out of here? Oh, I put, yes. I'm going to get one more batch. Um, I mean, I think if I was going to sit and eat these as a meal with some coffee, I'd probably eat of them because they're just tiny these are just tiny so I think I would probably have six these ones in swerve swerve is more fine finely ground than gentle sweet If you guys are not signed up for No Excuses November over in Flames Health Coaching, okay? I have some big things coming in Flames Health Coaching. Um, oh my gosh. Oh, I just broke that one. Are you going to eat that? It's good. <laughs> They're, They're just like what you buy out of the store. They're so cute. Now I wish I'd made a triple batch. Um, Flames group coaching is my group setting. I have two options for you. You can get group coaching on Facebook in an amazing group of women. Or you can get group coaching on Telegram. In the group, you get a weekly menu. You get a weekly education you get um, a weekly Monday night Zoom, which is available for replay. Any cooking class that I do, you get a free seat in, which are normally $20, $24. You get unbelievable support from other women and encouragement. You get access to exclusive Marco Polo groups, a big group full of hundreds of women and then smaller groups full of like 20 women that you will become besties with absolute besties with in this group you get daily check-ins on your progress you get 
weekly challenges. Every day I post a conversation starter to get you thinking and it's the same conversation starter every week, but it really, it's fun to watch people's responses to those change over the, the period of time. In my group, I focus on keeping you on plan 100% of the time because mama, I'm telling you, when you go 100% on plan, you keep both feet on plan instead of one in and one out. There is no comparison to life. It's so much easier, isn't it? To be 100% on plan than it is to be off plan some pause. of the time. Oh, I gotta pause for a moment. So you get all of that in my group for $89 a month. And the thing about my group, you can join anytime and your subscription auto renews. And if you want to cancel, if you want to stay for one month, you just cancel before your next um, charge and you'll get that full 30 days. So if you join my coaching group right now, we are doing no excuses November and we will challenge the excuses that we make for ourselves that keep us from staying on plan. Excuses like, oh, but I'm too busy. Uh, but it's my birthday. But I'm too lazy. But, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm telling you, change comes when you are 100% on plan. Mindset change comes. Staying on plan is not about willpower, you guys. It is about support. It is about support and it is about mindset. So if you are not, holy crap, that's yeah. a lot of hydrates. Yeah, I guess it is. It's too bigger old. than I thought. <laughs> Well, I'll drink a little bit and add more water. Just pouring half my bulk hydrates into one cup. I should have made a quart. <laughs> so if you go to my website, www.joyfullifewithkj.com and click on coaching classes, you can see all that I have to offer there. Also, if you want to have a text notification when I go live, make sure you go to my website, again, www.joyfullifewithkj.com and you will get a text notification before I go live for cooking and devotions in the morning. Fair warning, if you are on the West Coast, you'll be getting text at 4 a.m. So, because I go live at seven, around 7 a.m. All right. We got one more batch to go. Gotta let these ones cool for a minute before we coat them. Um, I wanna do, I think, a few, half of these in powdered sugar, powdered sweetener, I mean, and half of them with peanut butter topping. We're gonna make some peanut butter topping to go on these. And then we might have two more batches in this bowl. Oh my word, I think I might need to wash this apron today. There's a possibility. Yes, the only tweak I made to these is that instead of cooking them in an oven, I'm cooking them in a mini donut maker. Whoops, there's some batter on the floor. And I used half a cup, this is a double batch, half a cup of no carb easy bread. Not mandatory, use the baking blend, you'll be fine if you don't have the no carb easy bread. Um, and then Greek yogurt instead of sour cream. And I actually use dairy free yogurt. The only dairy in these is my butter. Are those cheaper on Amazon or in Bed Bath & Beyond? Ah, uh, Amazon. Yeah, I think I paid $20 for it on Amazon. When I ordered it, I was like, yeah, that's just what I need, something I'll never use. And it's been sitting under my kitchen table for almost a month. I remember when you ordered it. Um, get a donut pan, Mallory. You can get little mini donut pans. I do have one somewhere. And you cook them in the oven. I think these hold together together better with the donut maker than they do uh, without. That's not hardening enough yet. It's going to require refrigerating. She is down almost, she's down to like 141. How many days on plan, Mom? She had to go pee. She'll be back. After this brief intermission. Yes, Marianne, great suggestion. Mini muffin tins. Those work great. Yes. Yep. 
I think the donut pans are bigger. They're bigger donuts. I think so, Nikki, because I have made basic donuts without a donut maker before, and they've been, they crumble, and they don't get the crispier coating. These get a pretty crispy coating because of the donut maker. How many days on plan? Me? Yeah. She doesn't know. She's got to go look at her phone. See if I got her beat. Let me see. How many oh, days? Gosh, I know you do. I'm day 763. No cheats. Man. That's your Dexcom, not Man. your days on plan. It's right there. 555. 555 days on plan. It could be 556 today at 4 o'clock. Oh, at 4 p.m. it switches over. She, yeah. She's got that down pat. She knows if, I don't want to do these until they're cool. All right. Peanut butter icing. You don't have to do that right this minute if you want to make peanut butter icing with me. Um, Tracy told me what she does for peanut butter icing and I don't remember. What should I do for peanut butter icing? I don't know what that is, Starlet. I don't know what that is. So I can't tell you because I don't know what Paramount crystals are made from. What are they made out of? Where did that rest of my batter go? Oh, it's right there. All right. I don't know what that is. Somebody tell me what Paramount crystals are. Oh, paraffin? Yes, Starlet. Yes, you could use paraffin wax. Yeah, 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 sure. That would be fine. Yeah. That would be fine. Paraffin is fine. This will harden in the fridge, and I'm going to store these in the cold anyway because trim, well, <laughs> chocolate all over the cover. Trim Healthy Mama is so much better. The baked goods are so much better out of the fridge. Sure, Marianne, I bet they would work as waffles. They're not going to taste like donuts. I mean, they'll taste the same, but they'll, they won't they will look like donuts, obviously. That was a dumb statement. Of course, they won't look like donuts. They'll look like waffles. Oh, my gosh. These little powdered ones are so cute. I can't stand it. Look at them. Just they, look they look just like the little ones. I do not think Gentle Sweet would taste as good because it's more granular. Powdered Swerve is the bomb for powdered sugar sweetener. Yeah. Look how cute I, they are. I don't have that. So. I get mine. I get you can get a mix, a big pet, big bag of powdered Swerve and brown Swerve online like together in a combo pack that's what i get um so you wouldn't want to put brown swerve on them no i don't think it, that brown wouldn't taste it wouldn't stick and i don't think i've ever seen no, brown either. sugar donuts i don't think it would work well i think you've made things we've never seen before well you make a valid <laughs> point. okay there's that um, and then let's make some peanut butter ones. Let's do one more bowl. Actually, no, let's use this swerve. Let's do some peanut butter, some creamy. Um, I need some peanuts chopped up. Let's see. Honey roasted, we need plain peanuts. Salted peanuts right here. All right, we need to chop these babies up. A little bit more. Toasted coconut, that would be good, Melissa. I'm just gonna do peanuts. We should try making savory donuts. 
with like gravy frosting and bacon hamburger she's not even listening to me she's like whatever i'm over here looking at my phone don't bother me well i'm looking for your amazon and i'm looking for your links and i don't see it i'm probably well, in very the spot very top click amazon faves close that and that yeah. brings you to amazon now anything you search i'll get credit for Some chopped nuts. Let's make a mess, shall we? Garlic bread donuts. Ooh, that's a good idea. I think I have. You put in dash and it comes up all these. Put dash donut. Yeah, I did. But it comes up with um, a lot all of brands. Master Chef. Okay, so this is the one right here. Kid friendly. Yep, 20 bucks. You're, you're buying this. You always get on there and buy things, and then you're like, I don't know why I bought that. I'm not going to make donuts. Now look, I pushed something wrong. Eh. Yeah. Do it again. Yeah. They're hot. Okay. Uh, rest of my batter. I got enough for like two or three more donuts, girl. I ain't wasting that. Two donuts. I'm gonna cook a whole. I'm gonna run this through a whole cycle just for two donuts. No donut left behind. That's my motto. Okay. Peanut butter icing. Brown swerve. Some smooth, creamy, on plan peanut butter. So the aquas. $19.99, and if you want different colors, $30. Yeah. I guess it don't matter what color. No. Where will I put that if I get that? Can you grab the almond milk out for me? Thank you. What a mess. What are it's too easy to spend money. It is. So too bad it's Amazon so hard to get it. it. Right. <laughs> okay. I'll let those cool a minute and then we will top these donuts. With some peanuts. These are gonna be good. These are gonna be good. Is that hardening up enough to double dip yet? If they, no, let's try it's, one. It's still runny. Yeah, but I, it's not completely, so I'm wondering if it will stick a little more. Oh, yeah, it will. It's sticking more. Just do it to a few. Use up my chocolate. These, I have watched Tracy do these forever and they come out so beautiful and I was like, I cannot put that kind of effort into donuts. These are a lot easier to make than I expected them to be. And I mean, this is a big batch. I'm taking these Except with me on trip. Except poor Tracy don't have someone there washing her dishes well, for no, her you're when right. she's done. Um, I, these are going to be perfect to take on my trip. So I don't feel deprived. I'm taking these home. Bull crap. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, just because I'm going on vacation, it does not mean I have to eat off plan. I'm bringing some things with me, some staples. I'm bringing my hydrates. I'm bringing my gentle sweet. My trimmy mix. My trimmy mix. So I'll have my coffee ready and bring my own coffee because I ain't buying no crap coffee at a grocery store. I'm bringing my unrest. I'm bringing... Um, I will bring some collagen, so if I need extra protein in something. When I get there, we will grocery shop, and I will totally stay on plan. Um, that Big Mac Daddy of Vanilla, Nikki, is from 
um, Sam's Club. And my peanut butter, Connie, you're welcome. My peanut butter is Skippy, no sugar added. It's mixed with palm oil, so it looks like regular peanut butter. And it tastes like, where do you get that? Right. Can I get that in hand? If I think so. I don't remember where I got it. Um, Might have been Walmart. Oh my goodness. I got peanut butter and chocolate all over my teeth. Oh, professional. That's right. It doesn't mean a vacation from eating. Okay. See, now these donuts aren't doing anything to my sugar. Not like oatmeal does. <laughs> All right, let's do a little peanut butter icing on top of each one. Now tell me, that is an absolutely adorable. Look at that. Can I taste that peanut butter icing before I eat one of those donuts? I might not like it. It's just peanut butter, swerve, vanilla, and almond milk. That's it. Pretty good, ain't it? I didn't measure. I just took a cup of peanut butter to it and put in some vanilla. Oh my God, they're so cute. I can't even stand it. They are adorable. I might need a little extra liquid in my peanut butter. Yeah, that looks more like frosting. Well, it's supposed okay. to be. I thought you said it was glazed. No. I said they were frosted. Well, I'm going to try one. Who's the donut lord? Oh, Tracy. Tracy's the donut lord. She would be proud. Yes. And I just put my chocolate in the sink. I had enough left, I could have done that, drizzled it like across. How are they? Good? The little added crunch? Oh yeah, these are, these are cute. As far as looks go, these are probably my favorite. They're just, they look gourmet. What is this, four? Okay, two of those. One of those. One of these, maybe I eat two of those. I don't know. <laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Almost done. That's quite a few many donuts we got there, Mom. Plus two, minus four that you ate, or so plus four that you ate, plus two in the cooker. Forty-four. Hey, that's all right. Forty-four uh, mini double, donuts. Double batch. A double batch. Forty-four mini donuts. I'll frost those when I'm done after they cool off. I don't want my icing to melt, my frosting to melt. I was gonna do some glaze too. I never got around to it. Look, we gotta move these so they can see. They can't see all the donuts. There you go. How's that? Beautiful. Looking good, huh? Look at all those donuts. Chocolate all over the counter. Mommy's right. here. Which one do I want to try? I'll wait on the chocolate because they're cold. I'll try a peanut butter. Very good. Okay, those are legit. Anything you buy on Amazon, if you're going through my link. Anything you buy. Oh, these are fantastic. These are fantastic. Very, very good. And I'm not much of a sweet person on a lot of this mm -hmm. stuff. Those, Those are great. Are the wow. texture is great. Spot on. All right. Thank you so much for joining Mama Joyful and I for a little vacation prep. I'll refill my coffee when this is over. The link, Betty, for the donut maker. 
If you go to Amazon, nope, if you go to joyfullifewithkj.com and click at the top on the link that says Amazon Faves, when you go into Amazon that way, it doesn't matter what you buy, as long as you went through my link, I will get commission on, and I sincerely appreciate that. I don't know, Nikki. I think it's just, I suspect it's, the dog's looking peanut butter off my legs. I suspect Tracy did it out of um, need. It's what she had in the house, so she tried it, and it worked so well, she went with it. The sour cream may be just as good. I don't know. But the Greek yogurt, I did yogurt. I did dairy-free yogurt. So the only dairy in these is from the butter. I could have easily used ghee and made these completely dairy-free. Yes, we are heading up there next, Mallory. After we clean up, we're going to head up to the post office. So I make these. I would just use the regular Greek yogurt. That yeah, I have. plain, no-fat Greek yogurt. All right, you guys, thanks for joining us this morning. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Listen, I will be live every day this week for devotions. Tomorrow, I do not know what time it's going to depend. Who knows, Cindy, how I got peanut butter down there, but I did. I will be live for devotions every day this week. However, I will not be cooking this week. So I'm taking a little break from the cooking just for this week. Uh, Kite Hill, Anne-Marie. So I will be back next week for more cooking. I'm sure I'll go live at some point. But if you are in my Flames group coaching, you will be under the wonderful care of some beautiful, amazing admins. Christy will be moderating Zoom on Monday night. And um, she will also be going live on Wednesday morning in the coaching group to cook with y'all. Um, the glaze, I would have just done gentle, I would have done swerve and a little bit of almond milk until it was a glaze and then I would have coated them. If I had enough for another batch, I would have done that. But, all right, you guys, I love you so much. Have a wonderful week and I will see you back when I return. Say bye, Mama Joyful. You're supposed to actually say bye, bye Mama Joyful. Bye. Well, I said hello, Mama Joyful. Bye, Mama Joyful. <laughs> bye. Have a safe trip home. <laughs> bye, guys.